If you've been around my channel or site for a while, you may have learned that I'm big on technique and sharing how I work, but I'm not so big on rules and requirements. What's an example of a rule in photography? Popular rules are the rule of thirds, where to crop a portrait, and some people claim to have rules on how to set your camera. Don't get me wrong, techniques are great, but you won't hear me talking about rules. A rule is something that you're supposed to follow. That doesn't sound like a lot of fun. Pick up your camera. This is your tool of artistry. This is no different than a paintbrush, a pen, or even a hammer and chisel. No one talks about famous and most often dead artists and says, that Picasso, man, what a rule follower. He followed all the rules and produced work that looks like everyone else's. Nope, the artists you've heard of and millions that you haven't made their own rules. They defied the logic and wisdom of their times and produced something that no one else had previously. Do they borrow techniques and practices from one another? Sure they do. And we're gonna start talking about those techniques this week. One popular expression I hear every time this discussion comes up is, learn the rules and know when to break them. That's fine. I'll never tell you how to think, but all you will hear me say is, ignore the rules, and if you happen to follow them or break them, it's just a happy coincidence. A month or two ago, there was a chart circulating online that had red and green lines showing you the right and wrong places to crop a portrait. <sighs> I posted a photo on my Facebook page the other day and I immediately received a few emails and a Facebook comment saying that I cropped out my foot and hand. I love comments and observations, but always keep something in mind when you make an observation. Will your observation create a better image or would it create your image? Remember, it's our individual styles that distinguish our work and no one ever stood out from the pack when they followed all the rules. Besides, my feet are ugly. We're talking more about technique this week, so stay tuned. And there is going to be some homework. I know, I know, who likes homework? This homework will be fun and probably won't feel much like work. Talk to you later.